Hello and welcome to We Heard It On The Radio. Today I'll be discussing Forgotten City, the newest single from Lindsay Sterling, uh, written for the game Rhyme, which I didn't know about the game until I heard the song, so it was a bit of a double introduction experience kind of thing. But, uh, well, I'll say this much, it's certainly a bit of a game seller for me. I. I really like the song. It it's one of her more classical pieces. It's not got any of the um, sort of techno influences or anything like that that most of her pieces have. It's kind of more in the vein of things like Gabby's song and um, the. Uh, more stripped down version of Take Flight. Excellent piece. It certainly gives this feel of um, fantastical exploration and new experiences and wonderment. Uh, I feel that maybe it could have mixed things up a little bit more. N not dramatically so, but it I did have this niggling feeling of it sounding a bit too much like other pieces she's done. But as it stands, it's still an excellent piece and definitely in keeping with the tone of what I saw in the trailers for Rhyme. I Hopefully this will spark off other games deciding to... Um, get her on board for doing some of the soundtrack and things like that because if this is the sort of thing we can expect f from her for soundtracks then there's a lot of games that I can think of that would actually be improved if they'd had some something like her stuff on it too many games to mention um, as it stands I mean, it'd be interesting to see if there's, if she might uh, do different uh, arrangements for it and things like that. It'd be very interesting to see if she could uh, add some sort of techno beat or something like that into the framework. Although I'm not sure how that, how well that would work. Maybe an introduction of orchestral side to it. So she, she's still doing the main aspects, but. Um, the sounds are emphasised by orchestra, but still, excellent piece. Definitely, definitely one that improves as you, the more times you listen to it. Which, considering I already thought it was a beautiful piece, it definitely shows a sign of a strong song. Well, it's always difficult to describe it as a song when pretty much all. 90% of her work is instrumentals, but, yeah. Musical track. Um, yeah, as it stands, I'd say I'd give it a 4 out of 5, because it's a beautiful piece, it's definitely got the feel of what it's aiming for, and... It's the sort of thing that can really engage you. I just feel that it could have done with a little bit of tweaking here and there just to make it a bit more uh, unique. Still, excellent piece. I'll post a link for it. If people haven't listened to it already, I'm sure they have, but this is one idiot's personal opinions of a track that people are probably already, well, I hope people are raving about it already, but anyway, check it out if you haven't already, and I'll catch you on whatever next show ends up being put up next. Bye.